something to wear to land the interview for that job you've always wanted. Perhaps something to impress the missus on Valentine's Day. Well, buy this Daddy Yeah t-shirt. And now, for 52 weeks only, buy one, get one, the same price. All right, wrestling fans, Thursday night is upon us. You know what that means. It's time for Daddy at Night. My name is Big Sean Kramars. That's Wheels with a Z. And that's with the dark Z. horse, Anthony Musso. This man is tearing through the competition here at Daddy at Productions. Picked up a huge victory over Ari Sampson last week. Back to do more damage in a contest with Adam Hassan. Mr. Mediocre, and I'm glad you got it right. With a Z, baby. Adam Hassan may have a health condition. He's got a big heart is what is being said around the gym. Let's hope he is like the lion from the Wizard of Oz and he just needs a bigger heart. Right. Here he comes, Adam Hassan, lion like, or heart like a lion, like you said. He does have that. He does possess that. That's going to come in handy in this contest because you need something like that to go in there with the Dark Horse. Dark Horse has torn through everybody Daddy F Productions has thrown his way. Adam Hassan is hoping to not be that next victim, but I'll tell you what, it's going to take a monumental climb for Adam Hassan to be effective in any sort of way against a guy like the Dark Horse, Anthony Musso. Absolutely. I look forward to this match. Adam Hassan has a lot of ground to cover to put a name and dent inside Daddy App Productions. And let's see if he can do it right now against the dark horse, Anthony Musso. Absolutely. Collar and elbow tie up to get us started. Wheels. A win here for Adam Hassan would absolutely cement him in Daddy App Productions as a, a force to be reckoned with and somebody to watch. Oh, no doubt about it. It will elevate him to the top of the card for sure. Look at him, he has no fear. Absolutely, off to a fast start. Look at the speed of young Hassan walking the ropes and over goes Musso. Have no fear, Hassan is here. Uh oh, Musso's got him though. Hassan too quick for it. He's gotta keep using his speed as to, as to his advantage because that's the only thing he has over the dark horse, Anthony Musso. Anthony Musso outweighs him and he has him by strength as well. Yeah, for sure, and I'll tell you what, Adam Hassan knows that, and that's why we're seeing an effort to use that speed early in the contest, but when brute force becomes a thing, hey, let's watch this one more time. And also businesses, if you wanna be seen by thousands upon thousands of people every week, and you wanna sponsor Daddy App Productions, contact the page, you can be the presenting replay, and you can show great highlights like Adam Hassan's start, which has come down crashing. What goes up must come down. That's the laws of physics, and unfortunately, Adam Hassan is a victim of them what tonight. A pin. Look at that pin that Musso had a, a, a foot on the chest, or the big heart, as some will say, of Adam Hassan. Only with a two, though. No, 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 no. This is not. This is the worst part of the broadcast every week. Adam Hassan is on Dream Street somewhere, set up. Shh, shh, shh. Oh no. Here we go. My oh. goodness! My goodness! Right to the center of the chest. Adam Hassan's chest caved in. All the breath gone. Musso is a vicious SOB, that is for sure. If Adam Hassan didn't have a heart issue before, he sure does now. That may have stopped or skipped two or three beats, but Hassan's still alive here. He's using it speed as an advantage of his. I mean, look at him. Oh, wait a minute, up, get down, planning Musso, here we go, quick cover, this is it, upset. One, two, No, and... no, just two. two. Adam Hassan catching Musso out of nowhere there. Sure did, and look at the face of Hassan. He's like, what do I have to do next? I just planted the moon, or the dark horse, Anthony Musso, right on his head, as you see right there. Right on the butt of the head, and Hassan taking advantage, has Musso staggered right now. He has done some smart things throughout this match by going for a cover when needed. Oh, well, rather than going to Braun Chiropractic, I'll tell you what, Adam Hassan went over to Musso Chiropractic and did not enjoy his visit and down with a spine buster. Big time with a cover, both legs covered, one, two. Look at the look in Anthony Musso's eye as he hangs on to poor Adam Hassan here. He sure does and he's looking for that Boston Crab, there, there it, it is. is. Hey, that's the Buffalo back. Crab and that's it. Adam Hassan mercifully Let's... tapping out. To the dark horse, Anthony Musso with that big W and rolling, and it keeps on rolling through Daddy A roster. Tell you what, Wheels, your boy Hayden Backlund better watch out. Oh, Anthony Musso is out. on a tear, and he's looking right at Hayden Backlund. There it is. No one can survive the torque on that back that Anthony Musso gets when he locks that crab in place. 
A human should not have to bend like that, but there nonetheless is your victor, Anthony Musa. Absolutely, stay tuned folks. Big main event, a big debut, and Jeremiah Richter, you're not gonna wanna miss it. Carbone's Pizza for the best wings in town, like these crispy garlic parm, or these delicious country sweet, or the heavenly honey mustard, the flavorful Cajun, or the original hot sauce that'll have you telling your friends, oh and let's not forget their savory barbecue wings, Coop's Mania loves barbecue wings. Get the hell out of here, cubes! Yeah, you hear there's like new, there's more flavor. Really? Yeah, you work it, you don't know. Well, you know what I'm saying. And don't forget to try our new flavor wings, lemon pepper, and Jamaican jerk, you jerks, and tell them that the business sent you. So now, step into a chicken wing. Yeah, yeah. Guys, where are you? Guys! Hello? Hello! I am Landlord! Known coast to coast like Barantos! And thank you for tuning in to Deria Productions! The number one in the wrestling entertainment. Let's face it, you are not getting over in the ring. Call now. Are you tired from your promos being the jabroni? Is your gimmick the laughing stock of the locker room? Call now. For just $89.95, you too can learn all the secrets to getting over in the ring and to have a serious gimmick like the landlord. What are you waiting for? You're only going to keep sucking. One, five, five, five. Pay rent! Teach your way to success. Call now, please! You are guaranteed great success with our many celebrity endorsements! I'm the landlord. I'm the landlord. I'm the landlord. I'm the landlord. I said call now! today and get your daddy a t-shirt and I will give mommy a special break on the rent. All right, fans, rolling on the action, going strong. Carbone's Pizza, the presenting sponsor for this contest. And there he is, just about as greasy as Carbone's Pizza can be at times. Oh, wow. It's the landlord. Listen, he's a very charitable guy and a giving one at that as well. The landlord. Listen, Give wheels. Giving? What do yeah. you mean giving? All he gives out is eviction notices. How is that giving? No, no, no. He hands out applications for his beautiful... Uh, lake house front <laughs> and you know this guy Will has it all stop? down we all know the deal with the landlord he has beautiful lake house homes that he rents out to people and and from time to time yes he does hand out eviction notices as well yeah he also doesn't repair mold in bathrooms and leaky toilets this but guy somebody does. who does is was yeah the janitor of grapplers anonymous trading facility was look at him Looking like a superhero on his stepladder. That stepladder has replaced many a light bulb in this building. We wouldn't be where we are without Waz. But Waz, I'll tell you what, he loves being a janitor, but what he also loves is being a wrestler. And Waz has to start picking up some wins, man. 
He sure does. He is on a losing streak as we speak because you want to know why they're big frame ours is because he walks into the ring and takes it as a joke. Look at him joking around with referee guy. You know, of course, referee guy thinks he's cool. I you mean, know. anybody who calls himself Flex, of course, would love to wear a beautiful scarf and glasses, right? I had no clue that was his nickname, that's, but hey, I that's guess... that's the rumor going around. But anyways... There it is. And the sound of the bell. Landlord is ready to get to work. Yeah, and Time is see. money, and money is time, baby. Let's see. I'll tell you what. Landlord does not like to work by the hour. He wants this to be over quick, but Waz needs a victory, and Waz is going to be bringing that fire. Let's see if he can be serious in this contest and, uh, you know, show that skill that he surely has. Yeah, the uh, landlord, flex your stuff there, bud. Are, are you talking about nobody flex wants to see as that. in landlord? Nobody wants to see that. Not a single soul wants wow. to see anything that just happened in this ring. Okay, well, I don't agree with that, and I would love to see more from the landlord. Let's show him what you're made of there, landlord. Yeah. Show, the, show the janitor. Wheels with a Z representing the vocal minority of morons living around Buffalo, New York. Hey, listen, the landlord is the man, and he's the one who who says, who comes right, or goes. All right, all right, all right, all right. How much did he give you to say all this crap? What, 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 what's your take on the till, Wheels? Listen, I don't take bribes, but I will take a hand out every now and then if you're looking to hand one out. Oh! oh speaking of handing one out. Yeah, Wise there showing, showing Landlord he is the man, which I don't agree with. Oh, well, you just said it, and you can't take it back. It's I don't agree with it. The world just heard it. Waz is the man. Quote, he Wheels thinks, with a Z. He thinks he's the man. I'm just... As a good broadcast journalist like I take, am, can't take it back. I'm saying things that he has said. All right, said. so are you going to issue an official correction then? No, I mean, I stand corrected. It, he did say he's the man. I don't believe it, though. Because Show if he, some respect for the man who holds this place together. And besides, listen, he's he got holds the place together with a, right piece, with, a, with a used piece of gum, all right? That's how he holds listen, things together. He uses gorilla tape. No, he doesn't. Nothing better. And he's got Landlord locked up here in a wrist lock. Hey, you notice anything different tonight? I, there's no Steve Gage and Waz is being serious. No, I said something different. That's that's not different because Gage has been choosing not to come to these matches and support his so-called quote-unquote buddy here. Yeah, his buddy is on fire right now. Just ripping apart the landlord. Landlord needs a minute on the outside to get his thoughts together. Smart move by a veteran wrestler, the landlord. I'll tell you what, if Waz wants to get ahead in the contest, he'd be out there right now beating on the landlord. You can't give no, this man a minute, but instead. Yeah, instead. Keep on going. Go. What were you going to say? Instead, making a mockery. No, instead, Wazamania is running wild, which I do like to see. I do enjoy, but I'll tell you what, Waz needs to get wins if he wants to be taken as a serious contender here at Daddy App Productions. And doing that when you got the landlord on the ropes on the outside is not smart. And look what it led to. Well, I guess oh. it worked out all right in the end, but still. Missing missing a clothesline was the landlord, and then taking one over and out. All right, here comes Waz once again. Head of steam, oh, right to the temple. Look at this, landlord looking for a quick strategy against Waz with a clo clothesline that he Look at sorely this. needed and missed, but then getting the taken out by got Waz. a minute to get his head together, but lost every bit of brain cells he had left after that shot. And you're seeing it right now. Landlord has zero idea where he is right now. Could be in, in Puerto Rico for all you know. He needs to get it together. Oh, oh nasty knife edge chop delivered by Waz. Now I'll wake you up. Come so, on. What, what do you got to say about Waz's in-ring effort this week, Wheels? Uh, I mean, he has the advantage as of right now, but he, look at him. He's taking a moment. You hear, you hear that? He's saying, you know, Steve Gage, I can do it by myself too. This is what I can do here. And I don't agree with that whatsoever. A yeah, story to see for sure. Big European uppercut from Waz. Still like a landlord. Oh. oh. Thought he had it. Not to be. One too many last week, it looked like. The landlord just leased new property at 1234 Dream Street. Place he does not own, by the way. Look at Waz calling for the Waz bomb uh -oh. here. Could it be? Elevation down it across the chest. Gets all of it. Going Smart for the move. Cover. One, two. Nope. Oh, just leaning out. No sauce behind that kick out whatsoever, but nevertheless, the shoulder up just in the nick of time. Landlord still has life to live. 
It might have not been pretty, but this. it sure was effective. Landlord popping his right shoulder up off the canvas so quickly to make sure that it wasn't a three count. You got to do what you got to do to stay alive, but nevertheless, Waz staying on the landlord here. Waz in a great position in this contest. Quite frankly, maybe the best we've seen Waz look in weeks here on Daddy Yeah at night. Landlord's got to get it together real quick, or we're going to see a big W for Waz. Here we go, using the strength as his advantage. I'll tell you what, this shoulder breaker we see from Waz, a oh. thing of beauty, high impact. Collarbone could be cracked. Here we go. Another pin, hook of the leg, two and. Still with that shoulder. Instinct alone for sure, Landlord is spent right now. Waz has this man right where he wants him. What else can he offer? What else can he do to put the Landlord to rest here he's tonight. He's going to have to go grab one of those kitchen sinks he just installed. Yeah, he's going to need a little bit of more than uh, the kitchen sink. He already threw the kitchen sink at him. All right, what next else does gonna, he have? Next he's going to throw the fridge. He's got to do something Whatever here. it takes, Wheels. Wazamania running wild. Oh, no, guy got crunched. Referee guy sticking his nose in the middle of business. It doesn't belong. Oh, no, Landlord Look at in the landlord. trunks. He's in the trunks. No, Taking no, advantage, no. big X hand. X hammer smash there onto the oh, you forehead. You mean brass knuckle smash to the no, forehead? No, it was all this, hand. Oh, no, come on, not One, this way. Two and this three. This is ridiculous. There it is. And once again, the landlord getting over by doing this stupid stuff and cheating. I'm sick of it. I'm sick of it, Wheels. Landlord look, using look, his. The man goes in his tights. It's right there on the replay. Someone's got to take action. No, he was adjusting himself and saying, here go, baby. Oh, sure. You're a, you are a moron, and I am heated right now. That was Waz's contest, and instead, the landlord collecting the rent, picking up the W on Daddy at night. Man, you don't love to see it. Let's just leave it at that, fans. But stay tuned. Big main event, huge debut of Manic coming up next. Jeremiah Richter, this is a match to see. We'll see you in a minute, folks. Grappler's Anonymous so special is it's a great team environment. I come here and I'm able to deal with people from all different walks of life, people who necessarily wouldn't be friends in normal life, but it's everybody who has one common bond and one common goal to be able to be um, great professional wrestlers. And I think that's what this gym provides. It's a, we have a culture here of hard work and a culture of inspiring each other and a culture of supporting each other to where when you come here, you can instantly feel that. If you're a new guy coming into the gym, I feel like you can feel the brotherhood, you can feel the team environment right when you walk in. And then if you are um, making a decision to stay and keep training, you eventually get integrated into that. And then the team just keeps building and growing with all different kinds of people from all different walks of life. And I think that's really what makes this gym special.
right, fans, it's that time. Dulce Panapinto, Attorneys at Law, main event on tap in a big debut coming out of Rochester's Flower City Wrestling Academy, the head trainer himself, Maddox. He says grapplers trains killers, and he's looking for a fight. Maddox in for a big one tonight, bud. He sure is, and he is looking to make a statement here at Grapplers Anonymous. The guy is not afraid of the killers that Grapplers trains. No, and he's got maybe the biggest killer that we have to offer here at Grapplers Anonymous in the dominant force, Jeremiah Richter. This man has been on the roll of his life at Daddy App Production, staring a match with Slade right in the eye, but he's got to get through Maddox first. And if there's a man to put down the debuting Maddox, no doubt about it, it's the dominant force himself, Jeremiah Richter. Yeah, maybe. I don't see it going Richter's way. This guy is the nosy old lady neighbor that you just, you got to keep on asking, why do you keep sticking your nose in business that it shouldn't belong in? And Richter is the guy that uh, will be answering that pretty soon here. So, sound of that bell, he'll be answering it. Yeah, he's, uh, he's got a, a big one on his hands. I'll tell you what, the young lion of the West Medic is an accomplished grappler. He is, he's been around the blocks, wrestled in every independent that means anything in New York State. Now he comes here where the best reside. He comes to Daddy App Productions and he's looking to make an impact. And I'll tell you what, there aren't many people who can pair in local independent wrestling to the size of Jeremiah Richter, but one of those men is in fact Maddox. Maddox may have a, a slight weight advantage here. Richter's got, the, Richter's got the height advantage, but I'll tell you what, evenly matched are these two men and what that makes it is for is a fantastic main event only the best here on daddy yeah at night gonna be a dandy let's see how it goes Maddox is a big guy he is a, he is one of richter's toughest challenges yet at daddy at yeah productions yeah for sure and they say that people just want to get in a ring in daddy at yeah productions and really want to test themselves this is the ideal place the main event is the spotlight Wheels, I'm not sure. This is a tough one to call. Richter's done a lot, but Maddox has as well. But what are your feelings on this contest? What a big one, huh? Yeah, this is just a feeling out process of two big guys wondering what one another is about. As you see, they're just pushing one another around that ring. But Maddox, it definitely, like you said, has that size advantage of Richter, over Richter rather, and I think it's going to be used as his, it, it, it's a, a big advantage in this match, it, it sure will, and uh, don't be surprised if you see Maddox just pushing his weight around Richter. Yeah, doing a great job of that at the start of the contest, just burying elbows and European uppercuts into the upper torso region of Jeremiah Richter. But Richter fighting out of the corner. Oh, pump kick straight to the center of the chest. Right the sternum. Look at Maddox, all business tonight. He is, he's not taking this as a joke. He wants to make a statement at Daddy App Productions. This is not his home production. Like, like uh, Kramars was just saying, it is not. And this man is looking to inflict pain on whoever steps in front of him and to collect W's. Yeah, I'll tell you what, if people in Buffalo, New York weren't aware of the Young Lion of the West, Maddox's goal is to change that tonight. He's doing a great job of it, but Richter trying to turn things around. Head of steam, oh, that'll change it. Size 14 to the face. Whoa, whoa, it's a size 16. Bad 18, journalism. No, bad 18, journalism. 19. What is it, 20? Wheels size is a 20. victim of bad journalism, as you see every week here on Daddy at Night. I thought it was a size 18. Oh, you're wrong again. But anyways. That's all right. Richter's really turned the tide here, starting to lay him in on Maddox. Look at, look at oh, referee right, guy again. again. Yeah. He, oh, Maddox whoa. might be hurt. Maddox needs a minute here. Richter really tagged him. Oh, that's cheap. Hey. Fell right into the trap, did Jeremiah Richter. All That's business. cerebral wrestling wheels. All business tonight for Maddox, like I was saying. He's he's taking advantage of every thing that he can. If that's referee guy they need to take advantage of, so be it. Yeah, for sure. First time ever contest, too. Not a lot of tape between these two gentlemen. And I'll tell you what, that makes for a real interesting endeavor. You've got to take every advantage you can, so I can't fault Maddox for it. And down with a side Ooh. suplex. Perfectly done, too. Yeah, Richter's starting to be in a bad way. Watch, watch this. Richter missed that big boot. Up oh. and over. It is so rare to see a man that size fly with that ease. Unbelievable it, stuff. Yeah, he is. He definitely is a big guy sailing through that 
Sky. Here we go. Quick pin. Just two. Smart move. Matic questioning. Guys, count there. I don't know. It looked really good to me, but let's see this, let's see this again. It looked it's a little slow. It's unbelievable to see this. All that impact. Yeah, all the weight just crashing down on the left side of R Jeremiah Richter. The fans are trying to get behind him. Let's see if he can rally. Oh, my goodness. No, he can't. His head just got lopped off by the young lion of the West. Wow. Well, Richter feeling that. This has got to do it. Quick count. Cover. Two. No. Just a two count there for Maddox. Biggest challenge the dominant force has faced thus far. This is good prep work for what he's got coming with Slade, for sure. Yeah, if he can even survive this match. Look at what he's already been through. Hell and back at this point. But Richter's still alive. Oh. Oh, right to the side of the head again. Just dissecting his opponent. That's not going to get the job done, Maddox. That's the second time we've seen that tonight, and it has not panned out yet. Anybody watching who's interested in becoming a successful wrestler, remember, lateral presses and hooking the leg are the way to go. And calling up Grapplers Anonymous to see if you could train at their training facility. Wheels, you're right. I missed step one. Grabbing him by the throat is Jeremiah Richter nope. looking to get him up. He could not, though. Scouted it. Whoa, wait a minute. Black hole slam. Maddox feeling that halfway through the canvas. Man, impact. You were a thud. Yeah. The whole the whole garage shook there at Grapplers Anonymous, and the crowd is going crazy. They want to see more. This is your main event, 7.30, Thursday night, Eastern Standard Time. We are on Twitch. We are on Twitter. We're on YouTube, Facebook Live. Make sure you hit that thumbs up button, subscribe, click the bell, and you will hear me, Wheels with a Z, every Thursday night and Big Kramer is on to my right. And not only will you hear that, you'll see the best wrestling around. Thursday nights are the spot to be. 7.30 like Wheels said, be there. Richter turning it around though. Here we go, quick cover. The leg. It's, cr it's crazy how quick this thing can turn around. Maddox had this thing cinched up a minute ago. Now Richter in a different position. That's how quick a match can turn around. Yeah, these two bulls have gone back and forth. A war of attrition in your Dulce Panapinto main event this week. Would you say you're paying close attention to your nutrition? Good job, man. I'm glad you're doing that this week. Once again, a horrible broadcast journalism from a horrible human being. They make them real dumb and Cheek Waga fans remember that. Never heard of the place called Cheek to Vegas. It sounds lovely, but never heard of it. Oh, will you stop? I can't say it enough. Looking for the boot oh, again. No, wait, wait, wait. Go, coming oh. in slow but ends up on the back of his neck. Jeremiah Richter finding himself in a world of hurt. Look at Maddox sizing him up. Huge European uppercut. Extra zip. Off the ropes. And down. Ooh. Two and th oh, oh, just come two. on. Richter slipped off of that slightly. If Richter would have been able to grab a little bit tighter, maybe some more impact. But nevertheless, Maddox on the verge here. Just needs one or two more breaks to go his way, and he'll come out victorious. Yeah, he is literally one second away from winning here. And turning I can point see that. after turning point, buddy. It's coming up. He's, he's, he wants to end this here. He needs to make a big statement. This is his debut match. You only get one debut match. Well, in that debut match, wouldn't you, would you agree Manic has made quite the statement so far? He Absolutely. Oh, the win. look at that. Oh, nobody home. Wait, wait a minute. Oh, oh there it is. Size 16 turned Manic inside out. Yoking him up by the throat and down. And down. Choke bomb deluxe. Two. That's oh, it. Three. No. Not like this, damn it. Out of nowhere, Jeremiah Richter, the dominant force, shows Daddy Ad Nation exactly why he's the dominant force, overcoming all the odds. Great debut for Maddox, but you can't stop the train that is Jeremiah Richter. And Slade better, better watch this. Look at that. That choke bomb. That is Slade's future if he's not careful. That, that's a big guy. I would say maybe even bigger than, uh, I don't know, many opponents, but... He is a big guy, nonetheless. The dominant force does it again. What a week of action, Wheels. Absolutely. I am Wheels with a Z. This is Big Sean Kramers to my right. Thanks for joining us tonight. Make sure you tune in next week, 7.30, Thursday, Eastern Standard Time. Take care.
Grapplers Anonymous. This is where you build killers, right? You train killers right here in Buffalo, New York. <laughs> yeah. Most importantly, Jeremiah Richter. I know something about training the next athletes, the next generation too, you know? I came here to test myself, to test myself against the grind, against these killers. And I have to give it to you, Jeremiah. You're the real deal. You're everything as advertised. Hey, you are no doubt one of the toughest opponents I have been in the ring with. And you've earned my respect. <laughs> Round two. Let's do it. What does Grapplers Anonymous mean to me? It's very dear to me because at a point in my life where I didn't really have a place to train during college, Grapplers was there for me. And no matter where I've lived, where I've gone, what promotions I've worked for, Grapplers has been there to help me work as hard as I can to reach my level of success and to reach whatever success I want to get in the future. As well as the brotherhood that we formed here with everybody that, that comes to the gym on a daily or weekly basis. Um, it's one big family here that everybody's included in, and that's what makes this place special. Even people who have been wrestling to come, you know, train and you know, hone their skills and develop skills, and actually have, a, to me, is a good time. Comfortable environment. We can uh, train with not only the best that the Buffalo area has to offer, but just, you know, top independent stars all over the world uh, that come and work with us, and just being able, able to help out the new guys and, um, being able to help out each other, whether it be for you know a big match coming up, or you know storylines or gimmick ideas, it's just everyone's creative ideas are just flowing always here. What's up, Danny Gay Nation? This is the big man, Jeremiah Richter. <laughs> I got a deal for you. This nice Daddy Ed t-shirt for only $20. Buy one today or take a size 14 boot to the face. Daddy Ed.